Hi, what's up people? This is Sith Fury and right now we are going to be jumping into episode 1 of season 3 of The Mandalorian. I am so pumped, I'm not going to lie. I am, oh my god, it feels like it's been ages since the end of season 2. It really has just, oh my god. We did get the book of Boba Fett in between. Um, <laughs> Hands down, the last three episodes were the best if you ask me. And really, I think the last three was nothing more than just a setup for this show. I am a little bit pissed off that we didn't get Mando and Grogu reuniting in the show and that they did it in the book of Boba Fett. I would rather that they had done it in season three. Plus, I think it would be very jarring for people who didn't watch the book of Boba Fett. You know, like they're more of a casual fan and they're only interested in, in the Mandalorian. Like they watched the end of season two and Luke takes Grogu off. They come into season three all excited and they're back together again it's but the only positive thing that i i can kind of take away from it is that this show this season is that jam-packed with shit that they couldn't fit it in all the stuff with luke and the training and everything they couldn't fit it into this season and so they put it into the book of boba fett to extend that show because let's be honest that show didn't really have much of a story so i i think that was like the the the, the smarter bet was to put it into the book of Boba Fett so we can just stay focused on this story for season three. That's my only kind of hope and, and, and kind of like positive spin on it, if you will. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm not going to go into like a massive recap because we already know where we are. We know what's happening. I, I, I just, I just want to get into it, man. <laughs> so we're going to get into this. If you're interested in watching the full length, there's a link down below right now. Plus, I think with my schedule and everything, Probably by the time you watch this on YouTube, I will already have episode two up on Patreon. But there'll be a link down below that will have full lengths and, and early access to anything if it's up. Links will be all down below. But for now, episode one, well, chapter 17 of season three. <sighs> Let's do this, man. So cool, man. Okay. What? Is this like a prequel? I swear on my name and the names of the ancestors. That I shall walk the way of the Mandalore. That I shall walk the way of the Mandalore. And the words of the Creed shall be forever forged in my heart. And the words of the Creed shall be forever forged in my heart. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. From this moment on, I shall never remove my helmet. From this moment on, I shall never... Oh, shit. Young ones, to the gate! Get back, get back! <laughs> Oh, it's, it's like a giant crocodile, it's rolling. Get down! No, oh, okay. <laughs> Mandalorian. The creed teaches us of redemption. Redemption is no longer possible. But what if the minds of Mandalore still exist? 
All was destroyed in the purge. Is this inscription not Mandalorian? Where did you come upon this? Jawas. They came upon it by trade from a traveler who claimed to have visited the surface of Mandalore. Then this relic only proves that Mandalore's entire surface has been crystallized by fusion rays. But a traveler was able to retrieve this, so perhaps it is not poisoned. If I visit the planet and I can bring you proof that I have bathed in the living waters beneath the mines of Mandalore, the decree of exile will be lifted and I would be redeemed. <laughs> This is the way. Okay. Okay. That's the plan then, yeah? <laughs> A lot has changed around here. Oh shit. Do you remember your old friend? That's crazy. Magistrate Karga. That's high magistrate Karga <laughs> to you. Come. Let's catch up on old times. It's so good to see you. Welcome back. It doesn't even look like the same place. I know, we've done a lot with the it. Little robots on his cape, cloak or whatever. God damn. There's a lot of money to be made on Navarro. I can see. You and the little one? You can settle down, you can hang up your blaster. Live off the fat of the land. Grogu. Come again? His name is Grogu. Oh, if you say so. Come, I want to show you something. Is he using the force to spin himself in the chair? Pirate King Gorian Shard's name is familiar to all in this sector. Come, join me for a drink back in my office. We'll toast to your captain. We drink here. That is a school now. I say it's still a bar. Now bring us a drink. Is there a problem here, Magistrate? Is there a problem here? What do you think? You paid us for murder and mayhem inside these doors. Sounds like you went soft. Try me. <laughs> Tell Captain Dorian Shard that Navarro is no longer friendly to pirates. Now get out of here. Wow. Like you would get it, wouldn't you? Like you've changed, you've tried to change a, a, a town. Then there'll be some people who haven't changed that will come back, you know? I can't serve as your marshal. I have something pressing to attend to. I didn't know you were here on business. What can we provide? I need him back. What? <laughs> IG-11 was destroyed on the lava river. This is just a statue. These are his parts, are they not? I need a droid I can trust to help me explore Mandalore. And he's that droid. Oh, shit. Okay. There. He's hooked up to power. Let's see if we can wake him up. What? IG are we going to be getting back? The good one or the, the, the bounty hunter? <laughs> Subparagraph 16 of the Bondsman Guild Protocol Protocol immediately produced as a tweet terminated. Oh shit! 
Fucking Terminator. Now that's using your head. <laughs> I think he defaulted to his old programming. Yeah. You think? It's too big a job for you to do by yourself. Fortunately, Navarro has attracted the best droid smiths of the Outer Rim. They'll have IG back to his old self in no time. Are you sure they're up for it? I don't think I can handle him with all his limbs if things go scud. Why don't you ask him for yourself? Who? The Anselans. Really? What do you want? Mando, he said he can't fix it. <laughs> he says the memory circuit is shot. Nope. Well, put in a new one. No, 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 not working. Don't make new ones. Very hard to find. He said they don't make them anymore. They're very hard to find. I got it. Buy new droid. This one, Pudu. He says you should get a new one. What if I find you the part? Okay, now, then no problem. We think. If you can get a new part, he says he can fix it. No! <laughs> no, Grogu. <laughs> no. <laughs> what the hell? Bad baby. Oh, bad baby. Sorry about that. He's young. Yeah, bad baby. <laughs> no, Grogu. <laughs> Come on, man. The engine on that does sound like an old muscle car, doesn't it? This here is your hyperspace map. You determine your range by looking at your fuel gauge. And this is your enemy proximity warning indicator. Hang on, kid, we got pirates. I've asked Mandalorian. You can't just sneak away after cutting down four of my brothers in cold blood. We're Pirate King Gorian Shard's men, and we'll answer to him. After him! <laughs> the little giggle. That is cool. Dang Ferric. They have a target lock on us. Stop where you are, Mandalorian. What the hell? Surrender your ship and I'll spare your life. Kid, never trust a pirate. So he's in you. Yeah. Pirate captain. I am going to Mandalore so that I may bathe in the living waters and be forgiven for my transgressions. You are a fool. That planet has been ravaged, plundered, and poisoned. You said that the curse was a lie. Make up your mind. Mm. If you want to go to the mines, be my guest. They're beneath the Civic Center in the city of Sundari. Thank you. And I will find out if the planet is really poisoned. Mm. Goodbye, Dinjarin. That place does look really badass, though. Oh, are you kidding me? Just like that? That was quick. Ah, oh, okay. So he needs to bathe in <laughs> in the water in the mines. Um, of Mandalore. Okay, okay, nice first episode back in. Like, okay, we we we're setting up what this season is now. Okay, 
it's just so good to be back. It, it's just really good to be back. Had a bit of a slow kind of start. I like how Grogu seems to be more confident to use the Force now. Even if it's just spinning around in the chair. <laughs> it's like, okay. Yeah, there's not really much to say is there about this episode. It's just good to be back. It's good to see them two together again. I, I, I just can't believe that we're going to bring back uh, IG-11. I don't know, like, there's a part of me that kind of wishes that they just bring in, like, a new droid. Because if you can, in a way, resurrect IG-11 now, then that kind of takes away his sacrifice at the end of last season. Really, if you think about it. So, in, like, a weird way, I hope that the plan fails and they can't bring back IG-11. But in the process of getting, like, the memory and everything... He comes across like a different droid or something. Because I, I, I do think that if we bring back IG, then, then like I said, his, his sacrifice means nothing now. But yeah, man. Damn good first episode. We back Mandalorian, man. Oh my God. Okay, I'm going to have to wrap this up because I've got other stuff and, and I'm running out of time today. Um, but yeah, good first episode back. Um yeah, if you're interested in watching the full length, there's a link down below. Go check that out. But for now, give this video a thumb up if you like it. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. And subscribe if you haven't already, man. All right? I've been Sith Furion, and I'll catch you in the next one, man.